Hi guys, so today I'd like to share something super special with you um, that's inside this box. And before I open up the box, I wanna tell you that this was a birthday present from my husband to me one year. And I am lucky that I have a husband that gives me great birthday gifts, but this was one of my most favorite gifts. Um, and this is a gift, he knows that I love handbags and he also knows that I love Marilyn Monroe. So he bought me this bag at auction um, from a company called Julian's. It's an auction house that auctions off um, items from celebrities and you can always find really interesting things. Um, so anyway, I'm a huge fan of Marilyn and he found this beautiful bag um, that she actually wore and I wanted to show this to you. So how this was worn, which is quite precarious. I don't know, I'm sure Marilyn dropped this a few times, but the bag sort of sits on this velvet, in this velvet thing, and then you put the ring there to hold it so you can wear it, um, I guess you can carry it like that. Like I said, it would be very precarious. Like I would probably be, it would probably be slipping out all the time and falling. And in fact, I think that one of the stones one of the stones is missing, so maybe Marilyn dropped it. Um, who knows, but um, I also, what makes it so special actually is I have to open it inside. So you have to see that it is basically like a time capsule. So you have these two dimes inside that at that time a phone call was a dime. So. Marilyn probably threw these dimes in there. And by the way, this was found in a storage unit and it was found exactly like this, so it wasn't touched. And you can actually see, I don't know if you can see that, but that is her blush on her powder puffer. And this tiny, tiny little bag has so many different compartments and look at that. And there you see, those are her cigarettes. Now. These cigarettes are really, they must be really, really old. Oh no, they still smell, but anyway, they're um, very old cigarettes and they are unfiltered, Philip Morris unfiltered. So Marilyn was a smoker, but let's face it, I think everybody was a smoker back then, right? And so then that's one compartment and then there is another compartment if I can open it up, if I can, it's a little tricky this bag. Ah. And then look at that. Inside there is her lipstick that fits right in there and her comb. And I love, actually, I, I opened this shade. I would never attempt to wear this shade, this lipstick, but you can see that it was, I don't know if you can see the color, but that was Marilyn's lipstick and it probably has her lip DNA on top of it. And the color is Jewel of India. It's a great name. So anyway, I just found this to be so inspirational and so cool. It's like a little time capsule and knowing that she carried it and that was her lipstick and these are her cigarettes. It's something super special to me that um, you know, I treasure and one of my best, most favorite birthday gifts. It certainly beats a vacuum. I can tell you that. So thanks guys.